right there. Okay, are you guys ready? This is gonna be a big in. I don't even know if I'm ready. Here we go. Three, two, one, and boom. <laughs> it's gone. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back uh, to Destructive Physics. If you missed my first episode, it was like four months ago, so I don't blame you if you missed it. But uh, this is a game, if you can't tell by the name, uh, you blow stuff up, you break stuff. And I love, I absolutely love games like this and I'm always on the hunt uh, for more stuff like this. So if you have any suggestions, leave them down below. Uh, in the comments. So, uh, yeah, this game's been updated since the last time I played. We have an inventory system, like a slot system now, kind of, uh, kind of like Minecraft, and actually a bunch of games do this now. Uh, but it's nice to have. So if we want to shoot a missile, we can just push seven, get the missile. There we go. We blow a hole in the side of the building. I don't know if this was in the, uh, this was in the last version of the, uh, the game, but... You can actually tune every single uh, destructive element here. So if we want to make the missile even more destructive, we can put it all the way to... <laughs> this is a bad idea. Uh, we can put it all the way to 150. So let's see what happens now if we shoot the missile. Oh! My God! Yeah, we just absolutely freaking wrecked this thing. Look at that. <laughs> uh, just something about that. Uh, just never gets old. Yeah, let's just... Let's just Spam a bunch of missiles here. My computer's gonna hate me by the end of this episode. I can feel it. Okay, we should actually, uh, we should actually probably, uh, turn that down at least, uh, at least a little bit here. We'll go half. I think it was all the way down here, so we'll put it maybe a little over half. Let's see what this does, uh, to our tower here. There we go. Boom! Yes! And of course, you can slow down time, uh, if you do want to see every little crunch uh, that this game makes. Yeah, it's a very, very simple game, uh, but still ultra satisfying, and I could spend hours. Look at this big pile of junk here. <laughs> oh, I love it so much. I believe a new feature uh, as well, if we actually go, go to the maps, we can change uh, the actual terrain here. We can even go to the moon, and it immediately just starts tumbling. <laughs> I guess there's no moon gravity. Uh, unfortunately, hold on. Can we make that not break? There we go. Oh, that's a new building. I haven't seen this one before. That's a big old building. It's kind of eerie being all the way out here, to be uh, completely honest. So let's see what else we got here. We got the dynamite, of course. So let's put one right. We need to find the supporting beams. There isn't any, but let's put one right there, right there, there, there. How about right there, there, and there, and see what happens. Here we go. Three, two, one, and boom! Yes. Oh, can we hit the other building? Oh, no. It fell like right between. Actually, you probably could have got all three um, towers down at the same time if we really tried. But yeah, I could see a pretty cool game coming, like an actual game. This is more of a tech demo uh, right now still. But I could see an actual game where you need to, to destroy as much as you can with as little resources as you can. I think that'd be a really cool. I'm, pro I'm sure that's probably where he's going with this. Uh... But, uh, yeah, I was actually just surprised to see that he was still working on them. Usually games like this, they're just kind of like a one-off deal, and they don't really build upon it. But the dev is actually building upon this game. It has a lot more uh, now than the last time I played it, which I love to see. I love to see. Let's see what else we got here. We're on the, the huge maps right now. This is just a, a massive building right here. And we can also go down and play in the first person as if we were a person, so... Oh, uh, we also have the bomb. We also get the tornado. Should we spawn a tornado on the moon? I kind of want to do that. But first, let's actually put a couple guys in here. <laughs> I'm sure you got, you're going to have a rough time. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Oh, my God. The first person, for some reason, is a little laggy. But, uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys are going to have a great time here. We'll put another guy right there. And let's put, uh, let's put some guys on the roof as well. There we go. <laughs> oh, no, you lost your balance. That's okay. That's okay. We're not going to worry about it. We're going to spawn a tornado right on the top of the building there. Inside the building, actually. Uh, but it honestly looks like it's not doing too much. I guess this building was uh, certified to take a direct hit from a tornado. But can we tune this? The power is at... Oh, wow. The power is really low, actually. Let's put that on uh, 
75. And for F5, Tornado, what's a bit? Let's make it a big old boy, too. Oh, this is gonna be gnarly, guys. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. There we go. Wow. Wow, it's still... Oh, oh, it's cracking a little bit. Oh, there it goes and just lifts it up. <laughs> Our guys on the top didn't uh, fare too well. So basically ripped the building in half and kind of uh, tossed it over to the other side here. Let's see what other, um, other maps we have here. Uh, so we have a flat map. The uh, kind of not flat Windows XP wallpaper map and the desert. I guess we'll go to the desert. Let's see what kind of towers we have as well. Do we have any big towers? Or are they just kind of like monolithic kind of towers? Yeah, I think they are. We got skyscrapers. What's the biggest skyscraper we got? Is it, I guess it's this one. All right, so the tornado actually didn't do as much as I would have thought. What about the black hole gun? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's just going to tear it to bits. And it all comes tumbling down. Oh, it's, it's so satisfying, man. I don't know what it is. How about we throw a cannonball at it as well? There we go. <laughs> it's pretty good physics for uh, for Unity. About as good as I could ever uh, expect from Unity. There we go. Our random tower. How many? How many? Um, actually, can we, can we mess with this thing too? Like the weight. Okay, it's the radius is already big. The velocity. We can make it go faster. Okay. Well, I'm gonna put that at the top. I want to shoot a hole directly through this building. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's what I wanted to see. There we go. It just absolutely shreds uh, the building. Holy moly. That was uh, insane. Let's get that spawned up one more time. I want to. I just want to absolutely destroy this as bad as I possibly can. So we're going to go to the TNT here. We're going to tune this radius up. Stickiness. I don't know what that means, but uh, we got the radius. So let's do that. And we're just going to layer this thing in TNT. <laughs> An outer armor of uh, TNT. So there we go. I don't know how many. I hope this doesn't break the game, actually, now that I think about it. I hope this doesn't break my computer. Uh, if you guys are seeing this video, then I guess uh, everything worked out. Uh, and if not, I am talking to myself, and I'm going to have to build a new PC. So we're going to hope for the best here. Let's put uh, one more right there. Okay, are you guys ready? This is going to be a big one. I don't even know if I'm ready. Here we go. Three, two, one, and boom. <laughs> it's gone. I did a magic trick, everybody. <laughs> don't pay no attention to the uh, the raining debris here. Yeah, that's that's not a problem. My goodness, did we destroy that building? Oh, there's one right there. <laughs> uh, now I'm kind of curious what would happen if we just put one like right there. Jesus. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Boom. Yes, sir. Indeed. Why is this so satisfying? I don't know. Just something. I think um, if you're into car crashes like I am, I think you're just naturally into destruction physics in general. I still remember I um, waiting outside the GameStop for a Battlefield Bad Company to come out because at the time that was like insane detail in the destruction that we hadn't seen before at least until uh, red faction gorilla came out which i still think is uh towards the top as far as the best destruction ever in a video game is concerned what else do we got here but uh yeah i still i still love this stuff i'm i i know you guys are probably going to comment down below but yes i am aware of that game teardown that's coming out and uh, yes you better believe uh, we're going to be playing it on the channel. Let's pull up this uh, Teen Titans <laughs> headquarters here. Let's put one explosive right there. And you know what? Let's put some guys around here as well. These are the Teen Titans. <laughs> yes. All right. Are we ready here? Where's my de where's my detonator here? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Put him Oh! Hi. <laughs> well, they're okay. From what I can tell anyway, yeah, it was just, it's just going to be raining pieces for hours. Boom. Yes. All right. Now I, I want to throw a, um, I want to throw a cannonball at it as well. So here we go. And boop. Oh, what kind of throw was that? Did it reset? It probably did. There we go. We can still throw balls at it though. There. <laughs> can we knock it over? That's the question. Look at all these balls, man. Too many balls. Yeah, if we do this enough, we can just absolutely flatten it. There we go. We cracked it in half finally. 
But uh, how much do these weigh? I don't know if it actually says how much they weigh, but uh, I'm imagining it's a lot. But yeah, it's, it's mostly just balls now with a pile of scraps. <laughs> but uh, can, did I already mess with this? If I haven't, we need to make this radius all the way up there. And uh, let's go to a different map here. And actually, let's go to back to the normal map here. I kind of want to... I, I don't know why. I just love the skyscrapers, man. They're just... They're too cool. Where's the big one? Uh, I kind of want windows on it, so I guess we'll just use this one. It's still pretty big. Pretty big tower. So let's put one of these right there. Yeah, and... and <laughs> I like how it makes like a ball of debris. That's so cool. You ever seen that... Uh, that What's that? It's like a it's like a fluid, but if you hang a magnet over it, it like makes these weird shapes. That's what it kind of reminds me of right now. Does anybody else see it? I don't know. That's just me. All right. I wish is there a reset button? Like a reset the map button? I don't know if there is. So I kind of just have to keep going and doing this. I don't know. There probably is and I'm just missing it. But it doesn't come out and tell you. What I think we have a couple other things in our inventory we haven't used the bomb yes of course the bomb and the uh whatever this is <laughs> uh i don't even know what to call this but i'll show you what it does uh so if we go like this it makes hell appear from the bottom and it just it completely demolishes whatever it goes through. and here comes our tumbling tower yet again there's something really cool about this one though i don't know i think it just looks cool more than anything i don't look at that that's awesome, man. I I'm, I mean, I don't know what it's. I'm a f ma I'm like a magician now, a magician warrior. And I can just conjure this out of nowhere, but it's still pretty freaking cool. Okay, let's reset that uh, one more time. Actually, let's go to the big one because I want to drop some bombs here. So let's try the normal one first. So that's a normal bomb. Still pretty effective, but um, if we were to uh, tune this a little bit. So let's make the radius like so. Gives us 175 blast powers here. And now let's drop one. And yeah, there we go, fellas. Oh, that is, that is insane. All right, let's get another one. Yes, sir. And you can just bomb. It, 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 it just levels the entire city block. It's awesome, man. It's awesome. I could, I could literally play with this all freaking day let's try out some other maps here let's go for a weird map here um so small maps what do we got here we got some weird shapes how about map packs there's some yeah there's some weird stuff in there. i don't even know how this one's standing look at that flex that doesn't look good we got a bunch of cups i guess okay that's kind of kind of strange i kind of want to try this one uh, I just, I don't know, I just like this wall texture here, or this wall thing here. So let's drop a bomb on that, and oh no, okay, we need to reset. My stuff is too powerful uh, at the moment. I just want to throw a normal cannonball at it like so. <laughs> it just makes a dent. Oh, oh, it's actually a pretty strong wall. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. What happened to my missiles? I haven't even used those yet, really. I need to get at least one of those in here. So I guess we'll replace this. There we go. And why is it black? It's blue right here. Everything looks okay though. So let's try that again. Let's reset the map here. What does one missile do? <laughs> oh, it just blows it to smithereens. But you know, what do you, what'd you expect? I mean, really, I kind of want to, let's do that one in slow motion. I think that one will look really cool in slow motion so we're gonna go all the way down to there here we go and slow it down even more oh look at it go this is gonna be gnarly guys here we go three two one and boom oh that is that is it chief that is it and that's why i love this game so much <laughs> i know it's so simple but um this is what I get enjoyment out, guys. If you if you want to know, I mean, I guess that you could infer that since I play BMG and Wreckfest most of the time. But if you guys didn't know, I love me some physics destruction games. And uh, this is just that in its purest form. I love it. It's pretty cheap on Steam, too. I'll have a link down below if you want to check it out. But I think that's going to do it for this episode of Destructive Physics. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.